you're still watching the ways now august 8 is international cat day a day to celebrate one of man's most common and ancient pets they have um they have even been worshipped as gods in egypt well it's not surprising cats are one of the coolest beings on the planet they are independent inquisitive adventurous and have an amazing physiognomy and the power to heal themselves at least most of the time. Oh, I'm a cat lover. I'm not. <laughs> I am so, like, it's not like I'm allergic to them, right? But if you give me a cat and a dog, I would most likely, most definitely <laughs> pick a dog. I better stay one for that. <laughs> Let's welcome Mari Coco. Hello, Hi, Mari. Hi, Hi. 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 We have missed you Thank so you much. much. I miss you guys so much. Hello, mommy. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> You're looking so amazing. How how have you been? Before we go into what's in the news, how have you been? Well, I've been okay. I've been trying to like cope, you know, trying to get used to the whole thing. It's taking longer than I expected. Yes. But it's okay. It's fun still. Well. Yeah, I'm actually having like, I'm, I'm having panic, not panic attacks, but in my head, I'm feeling like this girl can start crying any moment from now. So I'm just <laughs> Don't worry. Place. I had better plans to be in like in front of like a proper place, but we're feeding <laughs> as we're on the show together. So just yeah. Yeah, bear with me, okay? That's part of being a, a, a breastfeeding mother, like a new mother. Yeah. Having to take care of another mm -hmm. human being. Yeah. We love it all the same. But how have you been? I've been good, you know. Awesome. I've been alive. I've been taking it one step at a time. Awesome. It's, awesome. Not, it's not actually that bad. It's quite interesting. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Motherhood is a blessing. And trust me. It is. It is it's actually blessing. unexplainable. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, so what did you find for us in the news? Let's quickly start with you before you run off. Okay, so I heard Mark Zuckerberg is now a sensi billionaire. That means that he now has he has joined the league of people that has earned hundred billion, you know, US dollars, yeah. cash dollars, hard currency. <laughs> but the thing about this is that people are actually attacking him mm. for it because um they're saying that he's not innovative. Now recently I don't know if you know about TikTok. Yes. Right. Uh -huh. So um, Donald Trump is giving TikTok like 45 days to exit the market where people are saying that it's part of Mark Zuckerberg's plan to like um, Acquire you know, the send them off so that he can come and dominate because now he has something that's like TikTok that's called Reels. So people are saying that he's not innovative. He's either always killing ideas or he's always buying it off people. So they are saying that it is for that Donald is sending off TikTok. But Excuse me, but I don't care. I, mean, I just feel like he's making his own money. And I don't know if it's me too. I will, if I can send TikTok off, I will send them off. So yeah, that's what I have for you guys. Fantastic. What do you guys think about think, this? Moria, I think um, um, I, I kind of agree with you that it's not like this is a man who is strategic. In business, you have mm -hmm. to be strategic to keep climbing. So um, I don't know if he's the one who had a conversation with uh, President Trump to um, try mm -hmm. to kill TikTok. No, we're not sure, actually. Yeah, we're not. It's, it's, like, it's, it's like an allegation, like popular opinion that people just say things because maybe they need answers. So you make up answers sometimes. But I also think Mark Zuckerberg is a proper businessman and he should be studied. Mm -hmm. He should be yeah, studied. But they're saying, he, he's they're very saying strategic. That all all his recent ideas is not him originally. He's either always stealing it from one platform that is up and coming, you know, that has the potential of... Yeah, when he sees the trajectory that this is where they're going. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Well, that is what a businessman would do. Your fellow yeah. Nigerian businessman, Dangote, is he not doing the so same it's thing? Like, <laughs> I, um, it's like you create something yeah. and I see the potential mm -hmm. in it of and course. I invest in it or I buy it off. Oh. That's how business... That's how most businesses monopoly. work. Yeah. Because for you to be, yeah. for you to stand out, you actually must be a monopoly. Mm. Yeah, you have to mm. grow your business to that point. All right, Barry. So Sansi, Even if you, you have to point? copy, like, back to back, not changing anything, mm. you know, at least change something so that we know that, uh-uh, uh, this is different. Well, you know? business people don't think like you. You, you are thinking like a, an emotional somebody. <laughs> Well, I'm, 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 I'm sure there is a law guiding that, and they'll, yeah. they'll see themselves in court. I so know. what did you find for <laughs> Eventually. Okay, so yeah. I'm moving, uh, bringing us back to Nigeria, to creative industry. Interestingly, we're, we're discussing Nollywood, but um, 
Right now, Kathy has said that um, most dancers, because Kathy we know is like award-winning, fantastic dancer, that most mm -hmm. dancers, they don't have um, health insurance. And because of that, they use a lot of drugs. Um, during the conversation, we realized that her kids are moving towards dancing. We don't know their future yet. However, I'll quote her. She said more than 95% of dancers don't have, don't have health insurance. And uh, majority live a life of drugs, peer pressure, pure mental, poor mental well-being, and personal irresponsibility. Mm -hmm. And I tend to agree with her. We creatives we don't take our health seriously. seriously. And also, um, I don't know if dancers have an agency, but I know actors. Um, there is Actors, actors Guild, Guild of Nigeria, yeah. and recently they put that into consideration because. All the time we see top actors, A-list, maybe not right now, but back in their days, they were pretty big then. They would come out asking for money. So for, for funds. Yeah, exactly. And that's just painful. So I think it's good that AGN has um, signed an MOU with medical... Um, Insurance. Um, yeah, signed and I can't remember the name of mm. the hospital for medical emergencies and just general medical insurance. I think mm. it starts from August 4th awesome. this year. Awesome. So, um, yes, awesome. it's good That's news. That's fantastic. That's good news. So my story is going to be a quick one. Um, we've, 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 we've seen it happen over and over again. I just thought to raise it again because even today, um, uh, Fumi, our producer, was telling me about mm -hmm. her area. They had to block off. Some people couldn't leave their houses because tankers, you know, fell. So, um... My story says Tanka um, Dangote truck kills two in Lagos and um, Ogun State. So um, a motorist was killed on Lagos uh, Ibadan Expressway or Lagos Ogun Expressway by a Dangote cement truck, while a young lady was killed around 12:30 a.m. Mal two um, tanker carrying a 55,000 liter petrol um, petrol tank. You know, it spilled its content as well and the, the, the person died. So now the reason I'm bringing up this case, there's a petition going on currently for the young girl, Chidima. Mm -hmm. Remember the young girl that mm -hmm. was killed by a, um, a trailer driver? Um, currently, the one the parents are speaking yes, out, right? The, parent, the, the, the mother did a video, mother, very, yes. very touchy video. And, you know, it was, mm -hmm. everybody was moved to tears when they watched that video. Currently about 18,761 people have signed that petition, you know, and, um, we are hoping that this trailer tanker death would actually be eradicated from Nigeria because it's actually um, it's um, it's an avoidable death, you know. It so is. yeah, it's an avoidable death. So many things must be put in place, you know, for 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 containers for tankers. You know, what's the policy? Are they properly latched? You know, when they're when they're going, then can we just have a time for them so that they don't even interact with motorists? Because in Sena climbs, they have their own routes. They don't go through mm -hmm. the, the same road with smaller cars. So let's just find a creative way to avoid, because this is an avoidable death and it's needless. Yeah. Yeah. You know, I, I, I like the fact that you didn't mention roads because we know our roads are bad, quite frankly. But I've seen, for instance, the picture we have uh, mm -hmm. of, of the recent um, um, tank. The, yeah. the, the case you're talking about the road is not bad look at that that's yeah. a clean road yeah you know so in this case you can't reckless you can't driving it. can also reckless cost it. driving yes. so i think aside mm. from crying out on government government do this or government do that how these guys did did they actually go through fr frc <laughs> the FRS, training <laughs> oh my goodness i keep mixing it with broadcasting corporation yeah. and road safety <laughs> did they actually go through the right process before mm. they got their driving license do they have I, no, driving let me license who regulates just them checks. because they it's, need very firm checks that they don't usually carry out. Yeah, and their speed limit should be checked too, because sometimes I get tired. I'm like, I'm driving on along the express and I'm I'm doing eighty, and you're speeding at hundred. I'm like, no, sir, slow down. This Absolutely. is this is not like um, Lagos Ibado or, or, or what do you call way. it. We need to, you know, wow. it's not it's not wow. the express way. Calm down. That's uh, that's what we, we we thought to bring in uh, what's in the news today. So when we come back from the break, we'll um, discuss Nollywood and would hopefully also bring join our our guest for the evening. Stay with us. <laughs> 